Hello friends, I wish you all a very happy Bengali New Year and may God bless you with a wonderful 1426. Friends, today I will talk on Mantu test. I will tell you the uh, proportion of Mantu positivity in a person who is BCG vaccinated. Let's start friends. Interpretation of Mantu reactivity or Mantu positivity in a person who is BCG vaccinated is a total dilemma for a physician. What happens is if the person is BCG vaccinated and he turns to be Mantu positive, then the physician uh, usually get confused that whether the uh, positivity, Mantu positivity is due to mycobacterium tuberculosis infection or because of the immunity conferred by BCG vaccination. And interestingly, the proportion of Manto positivity in a person with BCG vaccination uh, is 0 to 90 percent. I mean, it is an all or none phenomenon. Some person can show Manto negativity if uh, even if he is uh, BCG vaccinated and few people can show Manto positivity and strong Manto positivity uh, when he is BCG vaccinated. Now I will tell you few factors which must be considered in this type of situation. The factors are like uh, the age when the person was vaccinated, the interval between the BCG vaccination and the Mantu uh, test, the uh, site of administration of BCG and the injecting dose of BCG vaccination. These are the factors we must consider before. Uh, considered before uh, coming to a conclusion whether the uh, the mental positivity is due to BCG vaccination or due to mycobacterium tuberculosis infection. Mantu reactivity gradually decreases uh, during the first five years after vaccination. There are lots of studies which show different results. One study was there where uh, patients were vaccinated after infancy and after 10 to 25 years the Mantu test uh, were done, it was seen that uh, the Manto positivity was related to the uh, age of the patient when the person was vaccinated but not the interval uh, when the BCG vaccination was done and the Manto test was done. So that uh, Manto positivity was related to the age of the patient when he was vaccinated, not the interval. There are other studies also which showed different results. Now I will tell you the probability of a positive skin reaction is due to mycobacterium tuberculosis infection not due to VCG vaccination. The probability will increase with these three factors. First one is the uh, increase in size of Manto reaction like uh, if it is 5 or 6 millimeter or 10 millimeter then the chances are less. If it is 20 millimeter the chances are more. Uh, I mean more in favor of mycobacterium tuberculosis infection. So first one is the size of Manto test. Second one is the interval. The, uh, the more the interval between BCG vaccination and the Manto test, the possibility of mycobacterium tuberculosis infection is more. And the third one is if the person is in contact with a person uh, or uh, with a patient of mycobacterium tuberculosis uh, infection, I mean pulmonary tuberculosis infection. So the chances are more. There are, I told three factors. Uh, which will increase the probability of mycobacterium tuberculosis infection. The Mantu reactivity is due to infection, not due to BCG vaccination. Now, the last point I'll tell you the most important thing is if the person is BCG vaccinated and he is Mantu negative, that doesn't mean that the BCG vaccination was ineffective as the degree of uh, immunity conferred by the BCG vaccination is totally independent of the degree of sensitivity to Manto test. So that's all about the relation with BCG vaccination and Manto test. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, uh, click the like button and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching this video. Stay healthy.